Hey everyone, I'm Ellen here at eTrailer.com and today we're going to be taking a look at the LED headlight bulbs. This is going to be the H7 style and the main benefit to these bulbs is that they're going to give you a really nice bright headlight bulb replacement that also throws the light a bit further down the road so it helps you to see better at night and have just overall better visibility so that keeps you safe and your family safe in the car with you. Let's take a closer look at these bulbs in particular and make sure that they're going to be the right fit for you. Again, this is the H7 style. So it has a plug-in that looks like this. Now this is a fit for several different vehicles. The easiest way to figure out if it fits your vehicle in particular is to use our fit guide here at eTrailer.com. You're going to put in your year, make, and model, and then go from there to find the headlight bulb replacement category, and uh, then this should be listed if it's a fit for you, if you haven't already done so. So another big benefit to these lights is that they have an internal heat management system. So you can kind of see these fins here. That's going to help to dissipate the heat. It is made out of an aluminum construction as well. So you don't have to worry about any buildup of heat causing any issues with your housing. Uh, it is going to be the extreme series. So this is intended to be used off-road only. It's not really intended to go on the highway. It's going to be pretty bright for most other uh, vehicles out there. So you want to be cautious with that or have that in mind whenever you're using it but it is intended to give you a really nice bright throw of light. I'm going to actually mock up a connection to our lights here with some little alligator clamps. Obviously whenever you're putting this on your vehicle you uh, will not be connecting it with alligator clamps. It will just fit in with your factory wiring so there's no worries about that. Now that I have that connected turn this on and that light's going to be very bright pretty blinding and you can kind of hear that there there's actually a little tiny fan in the bottom of this light that helps to keep it cool so definitely an advanced system to keep those lights cool and working properly for a long time Whew, that is bright i'm gonna have to turn the lights back on and turn that guy off because it's hurting my eyes. So that's what I mean by this being an, an off-road version. You really don't want to use these on the highway because you will blind people. Um, not literally, but you know what I mean. So again, that little fan at the back just helps to keep everything cool. So a really nice advanced system. The uh, lights themselves are compatible with 12 volt DC systems. Again, it's just a plug and play design and as far as the specs for this, you do get two bulbs, so one for either side of your vehicle. They are going to have a raw lumen output of 5,000 lumens with an effective lumen output of 4,565 lumens, which drops down to about 4,000 lumens after about 30 minutes of use. So what do all those numbers mean? Basically, the uh, effective lumens is going to be the, the number to really pay attention to. That's the number uh, taking into account environmental factors, uh, voltage fluctuations, things like that. The raw lumen output is kind of like in a perfect world, this light has the potential to be this powerful, but the effective lumens is more of a real world application. And even when it drops down after about 30 minutes of use to 4,000 lumens, that's still a really bright light. So no worries about losing anything that you don't need. Um, it's definitely gonna be a super bright light to give you a full range of view, uh, especially if you're going off on trails and uh, going through kind of rugged terrain or you just need a really, really bright light. As far as the other specs with these guys, it is IP rated at IP65, so that basically means that it's impervious to dust and that it's also going to be resistant to any kind of water. So it uh, should be weatherproof and dustproof, so you don't have to worry about that. It also is protected from shock as well, so again, important if you're going to be going off-road. The color temperature for these is 65 or 6500 Kelvin or 6500 Kelvin, which basically means it's just that nice cool white color. The wattage per bulb is 43 watts. The power draw at 13 volts is 3 amps per bulb. And our operating voltage is between 9 volts and 16 volts DC. It is covered by a two-year limited warranty, and that's pretty much all there is to it for looking at the H7 LED bulbs. Um, as if you want to get the harness to go with this, 
it does have one that works with it and you can either get the harness just separately to these or you can get it as a kit uh, I would maybe suggest going the kit route because sometimes that can be a little bit less expensive but it kind of depends on the application so um, with that I hope this video has been helpful thanks for watching and we'll see you next time